Okay, hello. Um, my name is Rajit. I'm an associate professor in Department of Bioengineering. Um, I've been here for about eight years, and uh, um, I had done my B.Tech and M.Tech from IIT Kharagpur as an integrated degree. Followed by that, uh, I did my PhD postdoc uh, from USA, um, PhD from UT Austin in biomedical engineering, and postdoc also from Georgia Tech in biomedical slash mechanical engineering. So um, after that, I came here, and our lab has been focused on working with the various aspects of uh, material biology interfaces. So we use a lot of biomaterials to do a uh, bunch of different treatment, bunch of different therapeutic strategies, bunch of translational research. Um, the focus has been to use these materials to develop therapeutics uh, and develop translational approaches in tuberculosis and osteoarthritis. Um, the idea there is can we improve patient outcomes eventually with the use of such materials, whether it is to do better drug delivery, whether it is to do better modeling of uh, tissues, or perhaps even some basic science with assistance of material. So yeah, so I think that's sort of the overall goal. The students, uh, we've had a bunch of different students from all kinds of backgrounds. We have people coming from biotechnology predominantly. Uh, but in addition, we had people from other fields such as uh, chemical engineering, such as mechanical engineering, that have actually come and applied themselves with even with no background in biology. And um, at the end of it, uh, they have been quite successful postdocs and PhD students. Um, people who have graduated have gone to various places. Uh, a lot of postdocs have gone to industry, about three, four of them. Um, uh, a lot of PhD students have chosen to go mainly for uh, further studies. Most of them are in the universities in US at this stage doing postdocs. Uh, one had also gone to Singapore. So, so this sort of whole spectrum of it, uh, um, um, so in that sense we have some lab alumni network that is established and, and of course there are a lot of current students uh, that are also trying to tap into that and of course learn from them uh, in terms of various career opportunities and also the research uh, follow-up that those people had done. Yeah, so I think uh, with that we can transition to maybe talking to some of the students now. Uh, hi everyone, I'm Vaishnavi. I am currently a fourth year PhD student in the drug delivery lab. Uh, my PhD project uh, focuses on uh, engineering a three-dimensional mimic of the human tuberculosis granuloma, which is an aggregate of immune cells surrounding the bacteria. Uh, so we further aim at understanding uh, host immunity against uh, TB infection using this model. Um, other uh, TB projects in the lab uh, focus on uh, addressing the challenges related to TB treatment uh, regimen. Uh, for example, one of my colleagues is doing drug screening uh, using a hydrogel-based co-culture system that we previously established in the lab. Uh, another team is working on uh, developing sustained release formulations of anti-TB drugs uh, to achieve uh, patient compliance because uh, this will reduce the dosage frequency. Uh, so overall, a lot of such fun stuff is happen happening in the lab, uh, which combines several fields like biomaterial engineering, immunology, and microbiology, and so much more. So if you're someone interested in doing interdisciplinary research uh, on translatable technologies, then the Drug Delivery Lab is a great place to be a part of. Hi, my name is Akshi. I joined the lab uh, three years back as a postdoc. I work in the field of uh, osteoarthritis. And in our lab, we use different strategies to target the disease. Uh, we use uh, different therapeutics ranging from small drugs to uh, growth factors and different delivery platforms, including uh, liposomes, PLGA microparticles, and hydrogen. We use these different strategies to target different pathways associated with OA, which include inflammation, oxidative stress, autophagy. In our lab, we have a mice model of OA, and we test these interventions for uh, therapeutic efficiency in the mice model. Uh, my name is Ashwant. I'm a fifth year PhD student in Rachid Agarwal's lab. Uh, one of the main goals of the lab is uh, trying to integrate phage biology with uh, drug delivery techniques uh, to, del to generate potent therapeutics for different bacterial infections, such as mycobacterial infections or pseudomonas serotonosa infections. And as a result, the lab studies a lot of phage biology, how phages interact with different bacterial species under different conditions, uh, be it non-replicating conditions or uh, disease mimicking conditions of low pH, hypoxic state, so on and so forth. 
and try to integrate uh, efficient pages that have been screened there with drug delivery techniques such as uh, loading onto PLGA particles and uh, formulating dry powder formulations to enable efficient delivery of these therapeutics into uh, the disease environments such as uh, mycobacterium tuberculosis infections in lungs, pseudomonas originals infections under skin, so on and so forth. Uh, coming to the lab itself, working in the lab uh, is uh, a very, it's a very fun environment to work in. Uh, Rachid always makes sure that he's available to meet students, be it through one-on-one -on -one meetings, group meetings, project meetings, or even for general discussions. And uh, the people in the lab are also very fun to work with. Uh, they're always ready to help each other and uh, the lab promotes a very uh, fun and uh, enriching environment to work in.